Bitcoin is getting ready for the next move and right now Bitcoin is in a very important consolidation range and in this exact video I will talk about the levels that we need to be watching right now here I will talk about a structure on the market that still looks dangerous in my opinion so make sure to watch this video till the end it's going to be very important and can we once again slap up the likes back above 600 that will be absolutely incredible and with that of being said let me jump straight away in towards the gum and first of all on the imminent short term we can see that there yesterday was a gigantic bitcoin pump after that there was a gigantic dump and after that we had a gigantic pump back towards the upside again be aware this move towards the upside was 10 percent towards the upside and after that we saw a decreasement of an approximately 10 percent before eventually pumping back towards the upside with another seven percent so there was a lot of volatility yesterday there were also more than 360 million US dollars in trading positions getting liquidated and that means that of course currently we potentially have right now the room to really move towards the direction that we really want towards since of course these positions got moved out of the market if i will be looking at the 4 LA time frame we can currently see that we're creating an important downtrend and i really think that this is the level to be looking at for bitcoin the four hour downtrend if we break above it that is really going to be the confirmation that we're probably going to head higher but currently yes indeed it looks quite dangerous for bitcoin and for me to really turn bullish on bitcoin Bitcoin, I need to see a confirmed break above the downward sloping resist line because also really after we saw a significant dump towards the downside it could just be that Bitcoin is currently potentially creating that lower high on the 12 hour time frame or on the daily time frame what means that we could be creating a left shoulder right here and hat in the middle and a potential right shoulder right now here what means that we're currently creating a lower high what means that we're of course in a losing momentum structure what means that of course Bitcoin is probably going to turn down its momentum and that Bitcoin probably is going to see that reversal towards the downside. So that is really where I'm worried about currently. If we confirm that lower high here, and if we're really going to go lower, and especially if we break below this upper sloping support line, or basically set the neckline for Bitcoin, then we are in some very big problems because then the hand and shoulders for Bitcoin will be breaking down. And to be very clear, if this pattern breaks down for Bitcoin, Bitcoin is going to fall all the way down to $24,000. So that is also still the target where I will be opening up a gigantic Bitcoin long position. And I will keep my eyes wide open on the price chart for Bitcoin right now, because if we do break below this level, it will will allow us to open up once again an amazing new trading opportunity so make sure to stay up to date on the channel right now here yesterday with my trade on bitcoin i was opening up a short on this resistance because like you can see in the past we were getting rejected by this level unfortunately i got stopped out of my trade here of course bitcoin still went down here but of course i already got stopped out of my trade since bitcoin first initially had a very big push towards the upside but right now i will be patient i will be looking for another opportunity and really if i'm going to look at the imminent short term we can really see a lot, a lot of indecisive momentum for Bitcoin and if you're really looking at the 12 hour time frame you can really see we're forming that downward sloping resistance line we're forming that upper sloping support line and basically the price action of Bitcoin is consolidating and will be experiencing a breakout once we either break above or below resistance and if we're looking at the time frame it could take another two to three weeks before we're going to see this breakout so make sure to be patient it still could take quite a while here but I would really call the momentum where we're really heading towards after we confirmed a break above or below this important level of support if you potentially want to be trading the hand and shoulders just like me or this big support retest what i will be doing as well don't forget to check out bybit in the link in the description right now because if you sign up an account on bybit you can actually claim a deposit bonus up to thirty thousand dollars and without this link it's actually only a deposit bonus of four thousand dollars so it's definitely a win-win scenario so if you're interested in trading bitcoin and all coins don't forget to go to bybit in the link in the description right now furthermore we can actually see here if i'm looking at bitcoin of course i've been mentioning this for quite a while right now here the low volume range here we can clearly see it it's between 27 and twenty five thousand dollars there's almost no volume traded in this level so that means that as soon as we do break below twenty seven thousand dollars or better said the neckline of the head and shoulders pattern we could be expecting that twenty four thousand US dollars as a realistic price target so make sure to keep your eyes wide open if we break below important support the next target is between the twenty four and 
25,000 US dollars. If I will be looking at Bitcoin on the weekly time frame, I still think that actually, of course, we could be seeing that retest of that weekly inverse on the shoulders. The retest is laying somewhere around 24 to 25,000 dollars. So yes, of course, what I really will be looking at here is that if Bitcoin breaks towards the upside and confirms the breakout of this downward stopping trend here towards the upside, we're probably going to head higher. And to be very clear, on the two week or weekly time frame, you can really see this level pointing out here, the 31.7k. In my real opinion, this is the level to break. As long as we're not breaking above 31.7k, I don't really think we should be necessarily be all too bullish for Bitcoin. So yes, I will be bullish for Bitcoin if we do break this downward slope and trend line here. But for the meantime, what I will be doing is just patiently wait to see which direction we're breaking towards. I mean, the momentum is still drying up here and the indicators are still telling me that Bitcoin is probably going to go lower and the price targets where big support is going to get found is 24 to 25 thousand dollars so still i will be a little bit patient maybe bitcoin is not going to reach that price target at all it could be but of course that is really the level where the risk to reward is extremely low so right now for the imminent short term i will keep on monitoring bitcoin if we're going to be breaking bullish we're going to open up a long if we're going to break bearish we're going to be opening up a shorting position at the meantime while all this is happening we can actually see that the bitcoin dominance is about to be having a breakout of the range here and if we confirm the breakout is basically going to confirm bitcoin season and yeah if bitcoin season starts altcoins are probably going to bleed and bitcoin is probably going to see more upside place where i would really start to be buying into altcoins is if we're going to be reaching this red box right here, I will be giving this the orange color. And if we do start to be approaching the orange box here on the Bitcoin dominance, that is the point where I would really start to scale into all coins. So yeah, it looks to me that we're going to have a breakout. And if we're going to reach this level, I'm going to go big into all coins. So make sure to subscribe to the channel to stay exactly up to date about that. But anyways, this was it for me on today's update video. These were the most important charts. And this is really the chart to look at what the next move is going to be for Bitcoin, whether it's going to be up or down we do know right now we're forming lower highs together with higher lows what means that we're right now in a consolidation phase and that we will be expecting a breakout to be happening anytime soon here so thank you so much for watching towards amazing new update video i hope to see you guys on the next one and peace out goodbye